Hi, this is Karthik from Fisherman Training Institute, Salala. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to create a table using draw table option in Microsoft Word 2010. Once again, I repeat the topic: how to create a table using draw table option in Microsoft Word 2010. So, in order to achieve this task, we should open Microsoft Word 2010. How to open Microsoft Word 2010? It's quite simple. Go to Start, go to All Programs, and go to Microsoft Office, where you can able to find Microsoft Word 2010 at the bottom. Just click Microsoft Word 2010 in order to open it. Our task: We want to create a table using Draw Table option. So go to Insert tab. and go to table just click on table where you can able to find draw table you just click this option where you can able to find a pencil to draw you just click drag and drop in order to draw it you can able to draw the table as you like okay now Use Escape to get rid of the pencil. Now select the table and right-click and let us say cell alignment. Let us say center. Now I'm going to type student mark sheet. Okay. So now I'm going to type the serial number, name of the student. And let us say total. Let us say specialization. Now I'm going to type one. Let us say two and three. I'm going to type the name A A A B B B and C C C. There is no need you want to provide the same information, or no need you want to use the same information. Your order to say. 89 and I say uh, 96 so I say 99 okay and special education let us say electrical let us say okay just right click in order to check the spelling and let us say it let us say math okay now here i'm going to type Fisherman Twining Institute, Salala. Okay, I need to change the text direction. How to change the text direction? It's quite simple. Where I can able to see table tools and table tools. Go to layout. Where I can able to find text direction. Use this option to change the text direction. Just click this. in order to change the text direction okay now this is fine so just select the text i wish to change the font size and font how to do this go to home and where you can able to find the font you can able to change the font and font size and make it bold and Select the text you wish to change the font size, and choose the font and font size. Okay, now I want to provide some color for this. Okay, how? It's quite easy. Just click, click this cell in order to provide the color, and here you can able to see shading. Go to shading. Just click and provide the color as you like. and i need to make it bold just select here is the bold just click in order to make it bold and regarding serial number name total specialization these are headings i need 
all the headings to be bold. So just select the row and make it bold. Now we are can able to see the table is ready. Now I'm going to change the border. How to change the border? So just select this table and right click, go to border and shading. Where you can able to change the borders. So you can use any borders and width. You can use any width. And regarding it's a box or all or it should be a grid or custom. So I'm going to select all and here is the option apply to where the styles will be applied to either text or paragraph or cell or table choose the option table and click ok in order to change the border ok I need to change the border color how to change the border color just select the table right click go to border and shading where you can able to see color just click the color and choose the color you wish to change and click OK. So now you have changed the border color. And this is how you want to use table option. Okay, once again I repeat how to use the draw table option. Go to insert and go to table where I can use draw table option. For example, I need to add one more. Okay, it's very simple. See, you can add one more. I need to add columns yes okay I need to add one more here yeah I need to add one more here you yeah, see it's quite simple so this is how you can able to use draw table option in Microsoft for 2010 I think you guys have enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video